Look at this. I'm freaking huge. Freaking huge, man. Alright. Welcome to That's Not Sexy. I am your master level personal trainer, Alex Diaz, once again in another video. And this video is going to be about protein in vegetables. So, uh, which proteins, which vegetables have the highest amount of proteins? And let me just say that this is for a hundred grams serving. Okay, um, we're not talking about like crazy cups and stuff. So let's talk about beans, lentils, which is high in vitamin B and iron. It also help, helps lower your, your cholesterol. So now when you get 9 grams of protein, it's going to help you lower your cholesterol. Why not? Why not do it? <laughs> so, um, uh, I know that soybeans are higher in protein, but I don't want to go into those. Uh, but I'm talking about just like red beans, kidney beans, lentils and stuff for about 7 to 10, depending. But lentils are about 9 grams of protein. Um, garlic, my raw garlic has six grams of protein, all right, and it helps lower your LDL, which is the bad cholesterol, and help increase your HDL, which is the good cholesterol that you want. It also helps um, for high blood pressure. It helps with blood circulation. It helps with um, your immune system. I mean, it's just there's a lot of benefits of taking garlic. The only bad thing about garlic is that it, when you talk to somebody you won't be able to get a girl or a guy because the bad breath so make sure if you do take garlic just to take a mint um, watercress which has three grams uh, protein uh, it also it, for one thing three grams of protein but it helps with anti-inflammatory or you I mean it's anti-inflammatory for you it's good for skin if it's good for acne um, it's is used not that it's used by doctors, but I <laughs> think it will help um, uh, with, with skin irritations and help uh, the inflammation. If you have skin irritation or inflammation in your skin, it helps decrease that. Um, also, this study is linked to cancer; that it's actually anti-cancer uh, food uh, because uh, they had a study with uh, smokers and non-smokers and the, the ones that had. Um, had watercress in their diet, uh, had either smaller amounts or didn't have cancer. I'm not sure the actual the specifics of it, but there is a link of uh, anti-cancer anti properties in watercress, and it's been linked to people that are smokers. So there is studies on that. Also has vitamin A and C. So about broccoli now. Broccoli has three grams of protein. Yes, broccoli has protein. Okay, and some guy in the gym didn't know that. Like, oh, I don't. What's, what's, the, what's the purpose of having broccoli? Okay, you have your meats, which has a lot of protein and creatine. You have your, you know, baby carrots and cauliflower, and you have your broccoli. So you have more protein on top of your your meats, and if you have any whatever chicken all that stuff with your beans too oh man if you have you have like steak or chicken with beans a small portion of course and you have broccoli that's like enough protein right there that's a lot of protein that's why I said in, the, in, in my other video it's better to eat your protein than to drink it um, you're getting way better quality protein from your from the food than you are getting from protein drinks but that's another video which I already did <laughs> so if you want to look at that video check it out it's on my channel um, it's also high in folic acid um, calcium vitamin C and and also fiber you know that you go poop to poopy poop um, asparagus is three grams is um, a vitamin A C E and K um, also, antioxidants. All these, most of these fruit. I mean, sorry, most of these vegetables are very high in antioxidants. By the way, uh, they also uh, this also has as far as it also has chromium, which uh, helps um, move 
glucose from your bloodstream into your cells. So that's another benefit of asparagus. Uh, Brussels sprouts is pretty much the same as asparagus. It's three grams of uh, vitamin K and C, antioxidants, and pretty much the same. Um, what else is there? Well, I mean, I mean, I guess for three, we'll, we'll just do three grams and up. So that's it. Cause everything else is going to be like 0. 0.5. So let's not even go to that. Three grams and up, that's the list I could conjure. Um, the highest, of course, would be your beans for the vegetables. And I'm making this video because uh, some people don't want to take protein shakes and they want to get, or they're vegetarians and they want to get the most protein from their diet. So I recommend uh, these proteins, these uh, these fruits. Sorry, these vegetables. <laughs> these vegetables for uh, for your diet. Um, so not only will you get the you know your protein sources from these these vegetables, but they also help with you know cancer, with your immune system, with eyesight, with um, your blood circulation, your cholesterol. This is there's so many benefits besides the, just the protein that you need, the intake that you need. Um, so I recommend eating these um, these vegetables. I would also, if you're not vegetarian, eat them with your steaks and chicken and fish. As a, you know, on top of that, like you have a little bit of salmon, you have your your broccoli, you have your beans. That's an excellent source of protein. So that's it for this video. I will be making more videos on. The next one, I'm not sure if it's the next one or what, to be surprises about nuts. All right, the, how much protein are nuts, the best nuts, and blood nuts. The benefits of fats, what fats are good for you. The benefits of salt, yes. The bad, you know, the bad sides of salt. So a lot of things that a lot of people don't know about. So I'm going to make a video about it. Also, I wanted to say thank you to all my subscribers and viewers for your support. Everyone's been just really kind to me awesome comments and messages and I appreciate all the support and love you give me. I'm giving you I'm gonna give you more videos and I'm gonna keep on doing what I gotta do to help you guys out. Alright? Um and girls. <laughs> so uh, I was gonna say and oh I'm getting close to my twenty thousand subscribers so thank you. Okay, make sure you are subscribed. Um, so make sure you like comment become a fan of my fan page buy my shirts and tank tops and all that good stuff and uh, if you're not subscribed that's not sexy at all so make sure you are and I'm freaking huge